It's kind of crazy how it works. Um, what we know is that, that uh, much of the fraud involves people's identities, like you and me and you know, everyone. We have an identity, we have health insurance, we, are, you know, we go to the doctor. It involves our identity and it involves healthcare fraud. And it's the intersection of those two, we call it medical identity theft, that is people that use your identity to rip off uh, the healthcare system. One of the things that we've been doing in the tuck school is we've been uh, doing lots of research on how do they get those identities? Like how, how, do they, how do they find out about Evan? How do they get Evan's name? And how do they get his birthday? And how do they get his social security number? And all that kind of stuff. How, how does that happen? And um, well, there's lots and lots of ways, and you guys have been learning about lots of them this week. Yeah. We've been studying one really kind of simple group of, of, of approaches, which we call inadvertent disclosure. And uh, inadvertent disclosure is when uh, healthcare organizations kind of in, inadvertently leak out your information. It often doesn't involve like a real hacker, um, but it has the same effect. 